everyone, it's Matt from Pixelate here. I hope you guys are having an amazing week. High School Years is coming out next week, guys. We are so close. We are exactly one week away from the official expansion pack release, but also the patch, well, it didn't come today. So it is most obviously coming next week on July 26th, which is a Tuesday, of course. So expect lots of news then and during the week. And of course, brand new content for me for high school years coming for the release. I haven't really watched much in terms of early access content from Game Changers. I know that I really should, but the game comes out next week. So I'm just going to wait and play it myself and kind of react to it there. But I've been seeing things here and there on Twitter, Reddit, Instagram, TikTok, and a lot of simmers are actually a little disappointed with the pack or at least disappointed with what they've seen in early access. It seems like a lot of corners have been cut and there are a lot of things that they wish would have been more in depth. I'm probably going to talk more about this after the pack releases after I explore it, but I want to hear from you guys. If you've seen early access game changer content footage, what are your current thoughts on it? Have your hype levels dampened or are you even more excited after seeing content? What I want to show you in this video, and it will probably be a short and sweet video. The Sims team made an official tweet today at 11 45 a.m. showing Copperdale High School yearbook. Now, like I said, I haven't seen any early access footage, so I don't know if this is something that's in the game or not. Based on things you guys have seen, if you have watched early access content, is there truly a yearbook in the game or is this just something for marketing purposes to sell the pack? Either way, I love this. I think this is adorable. You can see Bob Pancakes back when he was in high school when is this due again? Bella Bachelor. Still haven't met a blonde that's had more fun than me. Eliza Hastings. I'm going to create a business that is so perfect even the land grabs will want to be a part of it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, guys, the maiden names. Like, what? Mortimer Goth, woo her, admire her. Of course. Are we surprised? Nancy Landgrab, don't follow your dreams, follow the simoleons. So she's had that motto even back when she was young. I'm not even surprised. And of course, we have Jeffrey Austere, the Dish Mom. <laughs> I see, so Jeffrey took Nancy's last name and not the other way around. Ah, and look, he even has acne. I love this. Like, it's probably not in the game, but I figured I'd ask you guys because I haven't seen anything and I was like, who knows, maybe there's something that you can look through. I don't know. But my guess is that this is not in the game, but it would be so cool if even if they didn't give us functional yearbooks, if we at least got yearbook clutter. You you know, in build by mode so that you can place it down, even if you can't interact with it. That would have still been something, but this is so cute. Also, can these Sims be put on the gallery? Cause I would love to have high school young versions of all of these Sims, like the same ones that are here. That'd be so fun to play with all of them in the high school too. Oh my gosh. I'm even seeing tweets from Simmers asking about why your books aren't a part of the pack. And I can definitely see why. They definitely do have a budget from EA. I'm sure that there were a lot of things that they wanted to add to the pack, but probably didn't make the cut. And this was probably one of those features, though. It would have been such a cute addition to see that. And imagine having an interface and being able to scroll through. Like, maybe there's picture day. You get your picture taken. You put it in the yearbook. You write your own little quote for it, you know? And then you can have that and look through it and see back at all the pictures from all the graduates. Like, that would be so freaking cool. Somebody even pointed out how young Eliza looks like Lil Simsy, and I can totally see it. I wonder if there was definitely a connection in terms of inspiration there because we all know they named the cow plant after her in the game, so I wouldn't be surprised if this was a nod to one of the biggest, if not the biggest, Sims YouTuber. It will be pretty cool in the future maybe to see modders or custom content creators give us not just yearbook clutter, but maybe even functional yearbooks to where you can take pictures that you you took in game and actually create a yearbook that your sims can read in game like that would be so cool i don't know i'm only just dreaming at this point but that's gonna be it for this video i wanted to show you i thought this was so cute in case you guys don't have twitter or don't use social media i love you thanks for watching i'll see you all next time so long and happy simming 
This video was brought to you by my supporters on Patreon. Thank you guys so, so much for your support. If you'd like to join my community over there, a link is below. Thank you for watching. Thank you.